Okay, welcome back. Okay, this was last time we drew something client server web browser. Uh, get connect with a specific web server. You do online shopping, right? Amazon or Momo <laughs> or PC Home, whatever. Okay, everybody buy something we don't need. Okay, <laughs> and then we regret for spend a lot of money. Okay, what was our today's topic? What is our today's topic? We want to talk deeper about how exactly protocol. Uh, a mostly used protocol we used in web technology to access the web content and some relevant uh, terminology. Okay, of course, today our topic is HTTP. Okay, so what's its name? Okay. Everybody type the web address. You already type it, right? Okay. We type uh, edge. Sorry, <laughs> not this. We t we type the URL HTTP colon slash slash. Okay. For example, you want to go to Google. Uh, maybe uh, you want to check your email. Maybe Gmail. dot com, right? You hit the enter. Okay. We call this string. Okay, this string as a URL. Okay, so some people call it a universal resource locator. In Chinese, we go, we say that's a 网址啊。什么？你的网址是什么 ？Okay, okay, okay. But sometimes、uh, you have found the web address have a S. Okay, which means that you are now using. A secure version of HTTP protocol to access that address. So the transaction back and forth between you send to the server and you get the result back, or you send a credit card or the password, or they they send back to your secret things. Everything will be will be in a secure mode. Okay. And how do we do that? Because we have a technology we call a encryption. Encrypt, okay, I N C R.、Uh, encrypt. Ah,、uh, encrypt. Encryption, okay, something like this. Maybe I spelled it wrong. <laughs> Okay, terrible. I have a terrible、uh, encrypting means a kind of change the code in a way that people cannot、uh, decode it. Okay, if it's、uh, easy to decode, they are they will be cracked. Okay, there'll be some hacker. Maybe they will steal your your password, right? So we don't want that happen. Okay, especially things about the money. Uh, credit card personal information. We want to keep it safe. Even we send those information on the internet. So we have a very good as encryption technology. We can make everything send out. Even though you can get that information to you, it's a it's a it's a <laughs> it's a total mess information. You cannot get it. Okay, so now most of our web server and web browser, okay, I have to say most, they default they use、uh, HTTP secure mode, ah,、uh, to create to encrypt the data, send back and forth. Okay, so that's the HTTP and、uh, URL. Uh, why we talk about the HTTP because the URL. It means a universal resource locator.、Uh, it doesn't have to have only use HTTP.、Uh, they can 
mail too. Okay, they can they can have a link. They can、uh, launch the mail mail、uh, application, and they can be the FTP. Okay, FTP is a traditional.、Hmm, people still use it. Okay, uh, uh, file transfer protocol. So URL actually specify、uh, the way we connect to the server、uh, by the first、uh, protocol. Protocol and the server address, and they use a colon, port number. Okay. So port number is like a software、uh, extension socket allow the different uh, services uh, running and listen to that specific port.、Mm, let's assume that if I'm a server, I provide a HTTP web service, FTP service,、uh, terminal service. DNS service at the same time. Why? Why do I have to provide such a many、uh, so many services? Why not? Because I'm running the Unix、uh, Linux system. It's capable of doing this at the same time. Okay, that's normal. But the different services they they have to connect uh, to. Uh, Uh, they 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 share the same IP address, but they connect to the di different port. They have a different port connection. Okay, otherwise they will they will confuse the right. They will in inter interfere with the, each other. Okay, so port normally、uh, HTTP use AT. Okay. Uh, I remember eighty twenty one and twenty three. One is for、uh, sorry, I, I cannot sure. The one is for telnet, another is for FTP. Okay. Okay, so the different service use a diff different application protocol.、Uh, the application service use a different port number. Okay. So、uh, most of time we don't specify the port.、Uh, we just Use it by default. Okay, and then what follows is the we call the path information. Path information. When you access to that, when you reach that server, okay, the server、um, have a directory tree, right? A local system.、Uh, it's impossible to access everything on the root, right? So here is a server、uh, web page space. Okay, normally it's not a root file system, but they will map to a a page that you don't know actually the physical file is located. But you can get it through this through this directory. Okay, so so here is the path. Okay, I'm running out of space. I I move it here. And then the path after that will be the 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 file, okay. File normally is HTML, but it could be not a file. It could be a program too. For example, for the people who can write、uh, program,、uh, we can run the program.、Uh, we call the Uh, server side program、uh, could be in a lot of different language. Could be the Java script. Could be the PHP.、Uh, could be CGI. Or they used to use the name to call the CGI server side program, Common Gateway Interface. I remember. And you can actually send some、uh, parameters. Okay. Uh, different parameters, okay. Different parameter as an input to this program. Okay, if that's the case, wow, you 
you are actually connected to a server's program this program they do something but they return back the output will be a form of uh, html but do you remember our html page inside can contain the javascript code right so this way server side program they generate the new page they return back in the form of html but which also contain the dynamic page wow that's a front end side dynamic page web programming language and the server side back end page to generate uh, the new page or access the, to the different database okay let's uh, pretty typical web application okay so engineer or web developer uh, they may specialize in maybe uh, back end or front end okay but they will kind of know each other's uh, knowledge a little bit okay so in this class we focus on the front end okay in maybe in the future I will create a back-end uh, web technology okay I hope you have a big picture about this information okay later on let's see what the wiki talk about this okay bye bye